I'm uh, just going to do a very quick tutorial um, on on how you potentially look at doing the first part of your your sort of lampshade and where it attaches onto your your frame or your ball pole or all that sort of thing. Again, I'm just going to make up the dimensions, but uh, it gives you the idea of the sort of revolve patterns and all that sort of thing. So, create new document, call it lampshade part one. Like I say, these should be relatively straightforward parts because they're uh, they're all just cut out of out of acrylic or whatever on them. So I'm going to do top plane, sketch on the top plane. Start off with a series of circles because most of yours will be circles. So again, So this this time, in fact, I'll not do that one yet. This dimension would be the dimension of your ball pole itself, which I can't remember off the top of my head. The thread, threaded part on your your black ball holder. Assuming that you're gonna hold it onto there. Can't remember what that dimension was. 27.3, so if I make it 29, something like that. So that's the circle that goes through there. This one is potentially going to be my pitch circle, so basically where my holes are going to be, attaching it to my frame potentially, something like that. Again, it's just a then, so that would be 50. Minus of 40 mil. So that 40 mil, that would be where a hole would be. Imagine your your steel frame comes through there. So that 40 mil hole, something like that, would be there. And I'll just make this a, a nominal size. I have no idea. What mine was probably 80 mil, something like that. Again, you just make yours however big it it needs to be. In fact, I'll make it a bit small. Make it 60 mil. That one too. So, 60 mil there. Let's say that bit we're going to actually remove. That's just going to be for our circle. So, again, if you were you're going to attach, so again, we're just going to put a couple of circles in that position. Again, you need to decide what size screw you want. I'm just going to put it. 4 mils if I'm going to use like an M4 thread. So again, that gives me them them two circles there. Like I say, that one I'm actually just going to change that to a. Oh, sorry, get rid of that. So that I'm just going to change to a construction line because I don't actually need that. That's just for the circle diameter, how it would attach onto your frame. So again, you could do a number of them. What I'll then do is looking at the, the sort of cutout. In fact, I'm going to probably use a centre point rectangle. Again, I'm actually going to cut it. I think it'll be easier to dimension that way. I'll just change that back to a. Again, you'd have to decide this is from your design, but we'll say 10 to a 5 mil slot. Whoa. 5 mil slots. Again, you've done a bit of research on this, so this could be a. I'll just put a 3 mil slot, but again, you, just, you did the sort of working lessons to, to make that as tight as possible. I'm just going to select change them back to solid lines. So I've got my basic slot. Clearly that's going to get ignored. So I'm actually going to trim that off. That gives me that sort of 
basic depth there, so that's the, the sort of slot I'd end up with. What you can then do, do a circular pattern, just going to hold down shift and then copy that. Again, it's you know what angle you want that to be copied at. Oh, done that wrong, sorry. Oh, sorry, I should have done the sketch, so uh, let me just undo that. Keep doing this bit wrong. So you can see it's defaulted at three. And it's quite hard to see this bit. So there, oh, there's that one there. It's a number of. Change that to whatever yours is going to be. Let me have a look at ten. So I've got ten different ones there. Again, you could increase that to twelve. Obviously, all this depends on your on your design itself. But get the idea. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so again, looking relatively complicated, but we'll be able to extrude it from there. Like I say, I've not done much of the deleting, but I'm hoping that it's going to work all this out itself. So when I come to extrude that, yeah, you can see it's just picked it out anywhere. Three mil, that gives me that sort of basic sort of disc that I might use to attach my ball to my lampshade. 